So we're not talking about moralism here. We're not talking about turning over a new leaf. What we're talking about is preaching the gospel to individuals who are genuinely, truly, biblically converted and being new creatures begin to live a new way. You see that? But it can also refer to zeal, passion. It's amazing. You go to a, a football game, whether it's American football or football here in Europe, and see people literally almost, almost tearing their own flesh. To see them going almost wild. Any extent to see their team win, any extent to get tickets, any extent to buy the right jersey. Talk, 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 talk. That's all anyone talks about. In light of the Son of God suffering the wrath of God on Calvary and dying for us, what is that? What is football? What is anything? Nonsense and worse than nonsense. I'll never forget years ago when I was pastoring in Peru and it was the World Cup and everything shuts down, literally. And people would stand on the street in front of television stores that would have TVs in the window just so they could see the game. I mean, everything shuts down. And I remember there was this little woman in my church from the mountains. She was about this tall. <laughs> and it was a Sunday night. And uh, I was coming down the steps of this old building we used as a church. And she was going up, up the steps to the roof. And I said, Delia, I said, uh, I'm, I'm going to shut down the, the building. And she says, oh, I know, I know. In Spanish, of course. She said, I know. I said, where are you going? She says, I'm, I'm, I'm going to the roof to pray. And I said, well, I'm, but I'm closing the door. She said, I know. It'll be all right. So while everyone is going crazy for the World Cup, that so broke her heart, she stayed up on the roof of the church for an entire week, only coming down to refill her bottle of water, to fast and to pray that God's people, that their heart would be turned towards Him in a greater way. Do you see? Living for what really matters. Living for what's real. 